This seems like a great way to cap it off. I forgot the sound in this game is so funky. Bye. How's it going, man? Hello, hello, and... Hi, welcome to Chili's. Good to see ya. Let's get this show on the road, baby. Let's get this show on the road. Bye, how you been? How you doing? Ah. Uh... Uh, I've been doing all right myself. It's just been a long day. I'm excited to solve this mystery. Figure out what's what. Looks like we've got an update from... What? Not Morello. But the department he's working at. Mm. All officers who handled case file. That's our case file. Please report to the, detective the detective's office immediately. Thank you. So they're all going to... Okay, so there's something going on on Morello's side, too. He's hopefully informing the officers what's going on. And probably berating them for not questioning the suspects nearly as well as they should have. Okay, let's see here. Uh, Max. Oh, we got a video from good old Rex. Not Max. I forgot his name was Rex. Rex, Mina, and Arya. That's who, that's, that's who we're looking at right now. That's who we're looking at right now. I had too much money in the bank, so I used some of it to film this video. Here's a special message from Sexy Demise and Die. That's his name, Sexy Demise? Wait a second, is it a rap video? Interesting car hood. Kind of fun. I love my car. You know how much I love my car? How much do you love your car? So much. You didn't even pour that much in there. Also, should you be drinking if you're about to drive? He just wasted so much. What the frick? You know, like the flow's not the worst. The lyrics are pretty lacking. The beat's a little low. But the flow isn't terrible. This part's pretty bad. But the middle part wasn't bad. Uh, how long does this go? Why did you ask so much? That's a waste. Oh my gosh. Oh, whoa. So sick. Ah, gosh. New song. <laughs> Why did we download that? I didn't want to download that. The, uh, the middle part wasn't too bad, you know? The official audio sounds a hundred times better. <laughs> Does it really? All right, here we go. Let's see the comments here. You don't want your friends just pass away? Why are you posting a rap video? This video is horrific. I'm genuinely laughing my ass off. Couldn't afford a better production company with all of your money? That makes me wonder what else he does with his car. Ooh. Hello, did Mina Silva help you write this? She doesn't have the style. Sing along. Who you messing? Oh, God. Who's the stinkiest? Rex, who's the sleaziest? Rex. Uh, amazing. That's pretty funny, actually. Got him. It's just because Rex has horrible rot rhythm. Yeah, true. Oh, really? Huh. I had no idea he had a fish audio for this. That's yeah, not terrible. We're about to... Oh, that's right. Okay, so we got this video. And then we're about to start. 
investigating Rex, actually. Questioning him. Less so, as this is part of our investigation. This program, it, uh, it sounds like it helps people. This is the guy we're trying to get the information out of. That's right. I'm, I'm back in it now. We've been working for the rich for far too long. Rex wants us to... Ooh. Rex wants to liberate us. Here we go. Uh, from that, sign up today. Oh, and please let Rex know that I was the one he referred to. Al, out. Okay, and I picked up a new clue. Okay. Oh, my contacts are dry. My bad, my bad. Uh, let's see here. Let's check out what we just got. There's a new jabber post. Oof, and then we can start questioning Rex here. What do we just get? Hmm. No, we want these. Um, Alvin's hope. Rex is trying to change lives. He has good intentions, and I can see it for myself. I hope that you do too. Okay. Can I unlock anything with that? Nope, that's Mina's stuff, and this is Arya's stuff. Okay, let's see what we got here. Let's see what we got. What was our jabber post? Guess who just got their first recruit? It's this guy. Are you proud of me? What the frick? I'm your Hal Prentice and I owe you my life. Oh my gosh, dude. Al is in a little too deep on this guy. What kind of schmuck would you believe you? The kind of schmuck that just wanted information out of him. Look at what I found about your work. Huh. Hey. That's for paying members only. Delete it now or I'll sue you into oblivion. Uh. <laughs> I think you're the one who's about to get sued. Uh, Not before you get arrested for running an illegal business. Bada bing, bada boom. How is it illegal? But I'm just selling dreams. Ew. Okay, okay, okay. It was stupid and contrived. It was a stupid and contrived scheme, all right? But, but come on. People just want the entrepreneur image without doing any of the work. So I thought I'd give the people what they want, you know? You're just playing the system... You're just out for a quick bucks. You preyed on innocent people. What is this? What is this? Hey, man. It's eat or be eaten. You follow? And before you bring out the violins for these peeps, that lot would sell their grandmas for a new car. You really gonna pity people like that? So yeah, I got some flack for it, but some of them actually got off their asses and did something with their lives. You do have genuine fans. Do you feel any pity for Alvin? What are the what are these do? Are these bad? He's practically selling me this the scheme to himself. I barely had to do anything. You can't put entire the entire blame on me. I knew the risks. Uh I gotta I gotta go big to show people that I'm killing it. But maybe. This was riskier than I thought. I'm a pro. I deal with failure on my own terms. I have I have to plan it all out. What is going on here? Oh, I didn't find that one. Uh does this plan involve the Ripple Man's deal? Uh, you are very well prepared. Oh, he likes this one? I told you. I'll blend out. Is he very well prepared? And when Maya and I discussed this stupid deal, I told her I don't need some lame-ass, spoopy ripple thing. I had no intentions of hurting Maya or anyone else, too. Ooh, so is this like me actually starting to accuse him or not? Because I don't think I don't think he's the one who did it. I really don't. I just think he's a scumbag. Uh, Maya did have your back. And so, I mean a little bit. She did uh, send a message to jabber support in defense of him. Hmm. What 
What do you know about the deal? Um, I'll say my had your back. Give him a little sunshine. Yeah. Yeah, she did. We were BFFs, all right? But I trusted her. Maya was talking about containing this ripple thing. I should have paid more attention instead of writing her off. Try and remember. For her sake. You like that one? I'm trying, but... It's all... It's all blank. I was more worried about having to start from scratch again. If... We got our numbers wiped. Man. This is some bullshit. I knew stuff didn't add up with those two. You think one of them did this? This is bullshit. Well, dang it, that was the wrong answer. I worked my ass off to avoid getting played. Oh, and here I am. Back again. Think about Maya. Oh, yeah. Was she thinking of me? Uh-uh. Uh, she... Uh, should have packed up and ran when I could. That's, uh, really cowardly. I don't care. Fair enough. You go have your face off with this demon thing. I'm not gonna risk prison. For something I didn't do. Again? What do you mean again? Um, that's what happens when you try and trust people. Uh, dude, stop being so paranoid. Gosh, I'm picking all the wrong things. Easy for you to say. Not your life on the line. I know my odds in this game. Not like I can depend on those two to have my back now. You can depend on me. That's so bad. Really? Trying to pull that on me? Sheesh. Why would the rest... Why would the rest put themselves on the line anyways, huh? Because they have no choice. Dang it! Oh my gosh! Great. A bunch of desperados banding together. Okay, okay. Let's get this shit over with. My hot take? Mina. One of those girls must have done done it. Those girls are all appearances and no substance. Faker than a $3 bill. Probably that's why they couldn't cope with the hate. Why would Mina take the deal? How the hell did she get so popular after pissing people off with her lies? People were really dragging her out and shit. And then suddenly, right after we get this deal thing, she gets a record deal. And more fans? Alright, uh... What what lies? Because I actually don't know what she lied about. You gotta be kidding me. You know that whole Queen of Pain thing is fake, right? Her fans caught on to her goth shtick. Goth shtick. Could have ended her career. No way she bounced back from that without some extra help. If you know what I mean. She was going for the goth chick? I feel like she was just going for the super mopey stuff. None of her stuff's goth at all. Uh, Alright, what about Arya? I'm just going for information now. She's all about being glamorous. And showing off how in demand she is. Her camera feed is fake. Because she's insecure af. That deal uh, would help her... Get that prestige she wants so badly. Uh, so what if it's fake? Your whole thing's fake, Rex. Just in a different way. Then don't go preaching about how authentic you are. And, no, you know what I mean? And she's getting flack after people found out about the faking. You know, I've even seen her just tear down other influencers because they dared to be more popular than her. She'll, she'll eliminate anything. Or anyone. If they get in her way. Even Maya? Even Maya? She gets all antsy if she feels like she's losing her fashion queen throne. Even if her best friend. Arya. Or even if it's her best friend. 
Arya never liked being second best. She's not our perp. Uh, can I find more info now? Wait a second. Uh, I don't think she's our perp at all. Wow, and also, why would I tell Rex that? There's no reason for me to tell Rex that. Uh, reconstruct. Give me a second here. Ooh, not that one. We're going to try something here. Mean is contradiction? No. Um, that looks like Mina's guitar video. Hmm. But none of these. Hmm. You know what I'm saying? I don't. I don't think. I don't think it's Arya. I definitely think it's Mina. I don't have that. Mm. I'm gonna try it. I'm gonna say it, but I'm not committed to it. Ooh, got this from a friend in marketing. Bet sh uh, bet you her cool facade cracks if you ask her about it. This is Arya's fake sponsorship. Okay. Okay. Interesting. I'll look into this. Saving. Uh-oh. I'm not doing anything. Stop. No. Who's it calling? <laughs> no. 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 <laughs> no. No. Okay, fine. Just kidding, no. <laughs> Got him! No, they're fine, they're fine. Arya. Oh my god. Texting with Maya's phone is creepy enough. Can you stop dragging me into this? I'm not trying to call you. Can you stop dragging me into this? Can you? Wait. What? Is Maya talking through her no, phone right now? Be. You drag me into this. No. I would never. Oh. I should have expected that. I should have expected that. Okay. Oh, no. I don't like it. No, sir. No, ma'am. I've got some good news and some bad news. Which one do you want first? Um, give me the bad news. The higher ups know about our investigation. Oof, that's fine. Since I've violated numerous protocols and laws, they're considering misconduct charges against me. Worse, they're threatening to dis dissolve dupe and destroy all my research on simulacrum. That seems like overkill. Uh, who are the higher-ups? If I told you, I'd have to kill you. Literally. What the frick? That's not how departments work. Uh, there's a silver lining. They're willing to drop everything if we nail this case. I'll just do your job right. Uh, even though we threatened to... Blah, blah, blah. Stupid. We need the culprit who took the deal and any images or footage providing the existence of the Ripple Man. So, where are we on this? Rex thinks it's Arya. 
I don't think it's Rex. I also don't think it's Aria. I think it's Mina. So she pretended to be the promoter for the company. I wouldn't trust someone who can blatantly lie like this. Good job getting Rex to tattle. Uh, getting them to turn on each other helps us dig up more of their dirt. These kids are going down. But I do feel sorry for them. Be careful not to jump to conclusions. We need to be absolutely sure about who took the deal. I don't want this case unraveling because we overlooked something. If we make a mistake and screw this case up, no one will know the truth about these simulacra. And we'll go back to being treated like a fool. I'll just follow the truth, as a true reporter would, and get back to work. Two more left to talk to. I'll be in touch. Oh my. Okay, so also, we don't get... They changed the objectives in this one compared to the first game, where you just get done check marks. You don't get failures or successes like in the last one. But I think it did tell me... I don't know if those... Oh my gosh, I, here comes some intimidation tactics from the higher-ups. Something like that, we'll see. Um, I don't, but what I was saying, sorry, before I got distracted by this. I don't think, I don't know if the emojis on the text messages we were sending, like you get the sunshine or the rainy thing. I don't know if those were like right choice, wrong choice, or more of like stir the pot, make him happy type thing, you know? So, I think it's just two different routes to kind of th to take the conversation. But who knows? Who knows? A Detective Morella has been placed under observation. All junior officers and administrative staff. Uh, administrative staff, to please get confirmation from your directive superior before executing any orders from him. Field Team Delta, you are placed under special assignment. Please report back to HQ for immediate briefing. Oh, no. They're going to come after me. They're gonna come after me. Uh, let's reconstruct this with the email. And then we need to read this, actually. What? Huh? I don't like this face. What is this? Some yoga? Ew! What is up with her neck? No, no, no. So why was that recorded? Oh, there's the, there's the other Rex song. That's funny. Uh... Rex sent an audio recording. So the number two rule of hustling? Don't care. You've got to trust your instincts. Don't and care. Something tells me Arya will stab you in the back to get what she wants. Let your guard down and her designer heels will stomp all over you. She sure picked the wrong person to stomp on this time. Literally don't care, Rex. Uh, this. Let's check this out real quick. Statement on official muses. Oh. Oliverin's influencer or er, influencer partners, known as muses, our voices, our ambassadors, and a proud representation of our brand. These muses are carefully selected to fully embody our ethos. While we are proud to see fans emulate the style of our prestigious muses, a few have taken it a bit too far by calling themselves our partners or collaborators without our permission. These uh, mediators undermine the integrity of our brand and real muses. Stay true to yourself. Aria Park, fake muse. Oh, Aria. Aria Park is one of these unofficial muses. She claims to be our ambassador, but she is not affiliated with us in any manner. Uh, one of the ways to identify a fake muse from a real one is to look out for official tags. Real muses are required to, to tag a Lorian. Alloran? I don't even know how to say it. It doesn't really matter. It's a fake fashion brand. Um, at all their posts. 
while the fake ones tend to avoid it. If you spot uh, any other fake muses, please contact an official or any official on our channels, blah, 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 any of our official channels. I can read sometimes, not all the time. Um, be true, be you, be alluring. It is alluring because it's alluring, I see. Interesting. Okay, so we need to, that's, I think, going to give us a hint. I hate this background now. That's giving us a hint to look for a post from Aria where she's faking being a sponsor. Getting the hint from there. Turning that into a clue. Bada bing, bada boom. Yeah, that's the plan. Oh, let's read the TRM thing first. Um, TRM, TRM gave me hope for a new career on social media. My family didn't have a lot. We often lived paycheck to paycheck. I'm an only child, so my parents put all their dreams on me. I was destined to be a doctor or an engineer, anything to break the cycle. After graduation, I was offered a full ride to Ives. Things were great until my mom passed away, and I snapped. Life has a funny way of creeping up on you. My dad was supportive, but I couldn't stop feeling like a disappointment. Thankfully, that was, or that wasn't the end for me. Emily Wong. Sorry, I had to burp. <laughs> um, Emily Wong. Wait, isn't this a person we need? Oh, so that sucks. This person got roped in because of their hard... Like, this is like, they actually kind of... Yeah, I don't know. This one feels like a more of a valid reason to be drawn into this type of want, you know? Almost not complete necessity, but almost out of necessity. Miss, most likely to succeed. Cracked. Dang. Interesting. Okay. So nothing here though. Um, all right, let's check out your stuff. This one. No. This one. No. This this one. She hashtags Aluren though. Ambassador of Lauren already announces her partnership with the Lauren Rand, but the commenters are pointing out some discrepancies close to this announcement. Okay. Can't trust you now that you're a shill for big brands. Dang, man. I'm sorry, but something about this video is wrong. Amazing. Didn't think you'd get it since you're a smaller creator. Didn't you see? She's obviously lying. So, uh, no, don't they call themselves muses? She said she's, or muses? She said she's an ambassador. Like, she didn't even tag them. Isn't that weird? Oh, I guess she didn't tag them, did she? She only hashtagged them. Yeah. Mm. Let's see the video real quick. All right, chicas. So, super exciting news. Guess who's the latest Aluren brand ambassador? I'm so totally honored by this opportunity because I love, love, love the Alluren brand ethos, which is stay true to yourself. Now, you queens know that I only ever support brands that I really, truly believe in because I'm no beauty bot and you love these made me, so I gotta keep it real. That was it? I definitely thought there'd be more. But okay, oof, that's a bad oof. That's a big oof from me. <laughs> also, why would you fake being a brand ambassador? That's just the longevity of that is so bad, you know? Like literally either you get big. I mean, it's going to bring in more eyes, right? But then you they're just going to go like they did to her. Sorry, they're going to the company's going to go, "Uh, no, she's she's not affiliated with us." Uh and then you either I guess that could be more negative attention in you can turn into positive or just overall attention to use. That's possible too, I guess. So pretty weird, champ. Pretty weird. Haunting. What? 
There was the burp. Oh my gosh. A video of my seeing things. Not you. Do we have a video of Maya seeing things? Maya distressed? No. Uh, I don't think we do yet. But that is something new. Interesting. Okay, that's good to know. Um, But we can do fashion email. This one. Yeah, there we go. Recovered an email from Aria discussing... Aluren's rejection of her application. The liaison might have some more information on the situation. Hmm. All right. Dear Aria Park, your application to become an Aluren Muse has been received. Unfortunately, due to the sheer volume of applications, our review process will take longer than expected. In the meantime, you can follow up on your application through the hotline listed on our website. My extension is that. Oh, never mind. We need to know that. So we need to get... 8714, un momento por favor. I'm going to type this in so I have it. 8714. Okay. Look forward to hearing from you. Um, Maya, I'm, I'm beyond annoyed. Such an inconvenience. Look at this. Can you believe this bull? Due to the sheer volume of applications, blah, blah, blah. Like, how hard do I have to try? <laughs> Like, why can't I just get in? I'm the perfect fit for this. Someone's a little, uh... Ugh. If only I had a friend who could help me out. A friend with connections to Aluren. A friend who slays at fitness and curates diet plans. A friend that I dearly respect and appreciate. A friend that I'm forwarding this email to? But, seriously, if you know anyone on the inside, please, please, please let me know. Okay? Alright, okay, love you, bye. X. I don't like it. That's like such a negative way to network with your friends. That's super sus. Look, we're running out of time here, so we gotta wrap this up fast. Arya looks like a nice enough girl, but my gut tells me she's got a lot more insecurities than she's letting on. Mm -hmm. From experience, someone like that is gonna do whatever they can for validation. Yeah. Even if they have to fake it. Yeah. I think you should push her buttons on this. See if she's really as genuinely confident as she seems. Push her buttons. Push her buttons. Dude, this warden app is really something. I'm damn glad the department spent the money on this at least. How's it working out for you? No problems restoring the files? Uh, this software is amazing. It really is, isn't it? Uh, imagine unraveling a potential suspect's live just through their phone. Moment by moment. Every single thing exposed. Nothing stays hidden. What a wonderful time to be in a law enforcement. Oh gosh. You have some sort of peeping Tom kink. I mean, everyone has a right to privacy. As a journalist, you know. I semi-believe that. My character, I believe everyone does. I have the right to do whatever's necessary to get my job done. Hmm? Now's not the time for trivial debates. Enough chit chat. <laughs> we have to get back to work. I guess that's just character building. That's all that was. Um, okay, 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 okay. So let's try to follow up on the Aluren stuff. Also, I just got a message. Oh, that's fine. Uh, okay, so not phone yet. Email Lauren contact 1 800 Lauren. Okay, welcome to the Aluren hotline. Be true, be you, be alluring. Press 1 to ask about our exclusive deals. Press 2 to ask about our brand new loyalty program. Press 3 to ask about our Muse program. Maybe 3? If you wish to return to the main menu at any time, please to follow up on your application as our Muse. Yes. Please press 1. If you want to apply as we want to be our Muse, are you you enough to be a part of us? Hunt us down at our pop-up stores and get your applications filled. 
If you have already applied and want to get in touch with your talent liaison, please dial the four-digit extension number after the beep. 8714. Thank you. Your liaison is... Rachel. Rachel. Hi. This was a lot easier than the last one. However, your call can't oh! be connected as she's not at her desk at this moment. Come on. She's informed of your call and will get back to you as soon as possible. Have a nice day. I guess we did just call her at 11.49 p.m. Rough. I guess we did just call her at 11. Oh! But she's already messaging us. Nice. Uh, hello. This is Rachel. Hey, from Aloran. Be true, be you. Be alluring. Who is this? Uh, I would like to follow up on my application. All right, honey. I don't see your number here. Did I miss you out? Sorry, I can be a klutz sometimes. <laughs> if you have the extension, it means that you probably applied. Who's this again? Ari. Oh, what's Ari's? What's Ari's last name? It's Aria's last name. Is it Aria Park? It is Aria Park. Aria. Park. Uh, hang on, babe. Oh, hola chica. Aria. Yes, you're on the list. But it also says that here that I called you to inform you that you didn't make it. You don't like that? Oh, sorry. I, I didn't get the call. Oh, yeah. I got logs, you know. Oh, hang on. I remember you. You made the ambassador announcement even though you didn't get in. You know, you can't do that, right? Kind of a ballsy move. You're right. I'm sorry. Uh, wait, mm, mm, I want to see if I can get something out of her. I don't want to in impersonate her when I don't have to more so than I already have. Uh, I'm not going to cover her ass either, though. But we'll, we'll do this one. You're right. I'm sorry. It's all right. I know you... I know how you guys can become desperate, and I'm sure you'll do fine. Who knows? We have no policies for reapplications. You can always try again. Uh, I was going to call you, but about it, since you're here. We can solve things now. Any any feedback for me? Because maybe I can throw this in at Aria? Well, I'm just a liaison. So it's just my opinion. Uh, my boss thinks you're too aggressive. Personally, I think it's a bunch of bull, but I can't do much. I'm just the messenger. Regardless of how you feel, though, I need that video taken down in a week's time, if possible. I'll take it down soon. Mm, I, don't, I don't know. I'm just trying to get more out of her. I'm so happy we can have a mature understanding. I can do something for you. Uh, PR was going to push this out, but... I'm going to give you a heads up. Aria, you're feisty, competitive, and I like that. But uh, maybe hold back on faking things next time. Most people want us girls to just be all girly, but you're making us feel that we have to fight. Or, but you're making us feel that we have the right to fight for what we deserve. I really got to go now. Wish you the best, okay? Bye, Chica. Okay. Okay. So this gives us some, this gives us some extra energy that we can put towards Aria. Some extra feedback, some motivation, um, if we want to twist things for them or in her favor. Ooh, mind, body, fitness. This is a pretty big post. Oh no. This isn't as important as the fact that Maya just responded to this post. Can definitely 100% recommend this. The instructor's great. I was looking forward to it. Brother Jack. Brother Jack, I watched your TikTok today. 
The one about ruining my day by the way you ate string cheese? Let me tell you. I was a little disgruntled. But also that's how I that's how I eat string cheese too. Um so I, I felt you. I felt you. <laughs> Brother. Oh, also. Hello there. Hello there. All right. <laughs> Epic disgruntled moment. Top 10 epic disgruntled moments. Number 10. Watch how this man eats string cheese. What dating app is this? Um, this is not a dating app. This is Simulacra 2, an investigation horror game where you delve through a phone to try to figure out a murder mystery via snooping and friends. Oh, Pi, you caught up with all the VODs? Nice, man. Nice. It's not you're completely up to date with Horrorcraft. Probably know no more about it than I do by now, honestly. Because that stuff goes oof sometimes with me. All right. So let's... I still hate that background. Let's see what's up with Arya. All right. I gotta ask you about this. What the heck is this? I just... I just want to your explanation for this. Explain what? You realize the most influencers basically fake it till they make it, right? I just got smashed after having a switch for a year and the level CP, level 4 CPU start wrecking you. <laughs> Dude, smash? Sometimes it takes a second to get back into. Sometimes it takes a second. Smash is a good time, though. I, I haven't played Smash since college, man. But, oh, that was a good time. Good era. Explain what? Uh, make, make, it, make it right. You call me out when all the others are just getting away with it. That's a clear deflex. That does not answer the question at all. Um, by the way, I found you on TikTok, then looked you up on YouTube, and followed you on Twitch once I found you on the stream. Dude, Pi, that dedication. That warms my heart. That's awesome. I'm so glad it works like that. That was part of the reason I started posting on TikTok is because it's such a good way to get your name out there. Lucky high key. Like, yeah, and the, the hope is that train happens. Yeah, try you popping up. And, uh, listen, it, it could always be better. Like, I'm thankful for what it, I'm thankful for those who have found it so far, but you know, I always want more. I always want more. Respectfully. Respectfully. It's fun. It's a good time. Um, what are we saying? You guys are distracting me. Quit it. I don't do good with receiving praise. Hmm. Uh. Like, call me out when all the others just get away with it. Disrespectfully. I mean, you could disrespectfully, I guess. Uh, you're avoiding the question. <laughs> Fine. I admit it. The TikTok video was the one where I fought Jeff. Oh, yeah. <laughs> Classic. Uh, I faked my brand sponsorship. What do you have against me? You're just as bad as those so-called fans who just follow me to troll and put me down. I'm shocked that my terrible aim didn't deter you, Pi. My terrible aim and genuine fear. I was very afraid in that moment. I won't lie. I thought I was going to lose everything like I, I just recently did. Um, that's why, wait, that's why you went with, wait, that's why you want them gone. What? You're just as bad as the so-called fans who followed me to troll me and put me down. <laughs> Bruh. Aren't you all about keeping it real? What else are you lying about? Ooh, let's keep breaking her down a bit. Aren't you all about keeping it real? Real, as in being honest with myself? I've never compromised my personality, unlike those, unlike those cut-out cardboard beauty bots. I need that Aloran deal to boost my ratings, okay? You have to show that you're successful to get jobs. And... Wait, and perception trumps realness every time. I mean, you kind of lose everything. I lose everything a lot. <laughs> it's okay. Um, plus, Aloran's a big company. I didn't think they'd bother. 
Or checking someone like me. Oh, wasn't the Ripple Man deal an option? Oh, here we go. I never had the this conversation with Rachel. It's you. You you impersonated me? Incredible. You're blasting me for lying about the Aloran. And then you are committing identity theft. It's not identity theft. It's impersonation. There's a difference. Uh, listen, I'm desperate and make a stupid mistake. Sometimes I feel pressure to act like my life is more exciting than it is, okay? What the frick? Oh, no. But I can and intend to fix myself on my own terms. I never made a deal. I never needed the Ripper Man's deal. You are a fighter when things get hard. I apparently missed something else. I don't appreciate you digging into my personal life. Oh my god. Send her an 8-ball request. <laughs> but if it helps you make my... Or if it helps me make my case, go right ahead. You believe me now? I didn't take the deal with Ripple, Ripple Man. I didn't kill Maya. I would never want anything bad to happen to her. Rex, he disagrees. Rex. What does he have to do with this? That prick told you about the Aloran thing, didn't he? Oh, I'm gonna kill him. Yeah, he did. Uh, he'll say anything to get what he wants. Can't you see? You spoke to him, right? We're pitting him against each other. A half decent, a half decent sleuth would see he's a lying car artist. I do. Uh, he's pretending to help you because he can benefit from it. Cat, welcome to Chili's. How you doing? Hi, welcome to Chili's. Uh, how do I feel like throwing rocks at the windows after work? Two doubles back to back, and I feel like somehow avoid committing multiple felonies. <laughs> well, Cat, I'm glad you didn't commit multiple felonies, and I'm also glad you're done with your two doubles. I remember you saying that on Wednesday. That's brutal. Or was it Thursday? I remember you saying it regardless. I just can't remember the day. But think about it. Now you're done. Now you get to chill. Watch some spooky scaries. Watch me be a ter terrible sleuth. Uh, I guess, I mean, I can see right through him. He's pretty transparent. Then we agree on something. Chili says, maybe you want to throw up. No. No. He's a total grifter. Oh, he's a hella grifter. He figures out what you want and claims that he can help you get it while milking you for all you're worth. Uh, you're his ticket out of this mess. I'm sure he'll make use of it. Uh, I don't want to get too yeah you did miss Rex spinning some bars cat not gonna lie how long are we stream tonight um, until we beat this and then maybe more we'll do some if I beat this and still feel like I'm up to it we'll do some horror craft afterwards so it could be for a long while uh, hmm okay so do I want to keep talking about Rex or do I want to keep turning it back on Arya I already know, like, I don't need to tell all these people what their friends are doing. I really, that does not matter. Unless it's a way to manipulate them into giving more information to me. He's dependent on Maya. Because I feel like if I just tell her about the pyramid scheme, she's just going to use that as fuel against Rex. And I'm not going to get anything out of it. Oh, you want your name tag? We'll see. We'll see. Hmm. And by we'll see, it's all up to RNG. That's what I mean by that. <laughs> I missed so much of this game. I'm prepping the VODs tomorrow. So hopefully the first one, um, the first part of this, sh of part two. So the first part of Simulacra 2 should be up Wednesday and whatnot. Do Aria. Yeah, I'm thinking you love to lie to people. That's what I'm thinking. Because I don't think it's worth it to get the stuff like that. Could you please let it go? No, I'm serious. You can't take his word at face value. Don't fault. I'm not. She's so busy. She's not defending herself at all. Besides trying to throw Rex under the bus. I'm not. Listen, I know Rex. I, she's completely missing the point. Or she's purposely missing the point. And it's pissing me off. I'm just like, I don't care if you didn't actually do it. Just give me some information and quit trying to throw Rex under the bus too. Uh, I'm serious. You can't take his word at face value. Don't fall for his act. When Maya died, Rex's facade came crashing down. But how did Mina behave? 
Mina was acting all innocent and stupid at first. And then, after Maya died, she kind of suddenly became accusatory. She was the first one to call it out. She was the first one to call it out. She brought up the deal, made it sound like one of us did it. Why would she say that? Maybe she took it? I'm done screwing around back and forth. Rex and Mina have real reasons to take the deal. This, or sorry. If this influencer thing doesn't work out for me, I still have options for them. This is all they have. I mean, I feel like Mina could definitely do something else. You know, like she could come, like if she's just trying to be an influencer musician, you can easily get another job after that. Rex running a pyramid scheme. That kind of taints your business record, you know? Like someone does a background check on you, they go, oh, he ran a company. They look at the company, they go, oh, this is a pyramid scheme. That's not going to look good on a resume. That's your opinion of them? Why would Mina take the deal, though? I don't think it's Rex. I definitely think it's Mina. I mean, why wouldn't she take the deal? She's been fabricating personal tragedies to prop up her image. Doesn't that disgust you? Yes. Uh, but all of you do, so. Her fans are not idiots. They see right through it. I don't think they can take her suffering anymore. Air quotes. Fabricating. She suffered enough? Fab yeah, give me more. This is I wanted more of this from Rex. Charge your phone. That is actually how you see progress in this game, Jack, but you're not wrong. Um, the lower the phone battery, the farther you are to finishing the game. So we're we're almost done with the game. Oh, you don't know. That story about her best friend dying was a complete... Wait. Was completely warped to fit her narrative. She turned someone's, someone else's tragedy into a brand. How despicable is that? That's pretty bad. Uh, that's... It's revolting. Brother, that's wild. Here. Ooh. What was that? That was like... Scissors are like nail clippers in my ear. I didn't like that one. Don't know why why it happened, but here. Clear cut proof on how fake her stories can be. Maybe this will get her to squeal. Oh local star swimmer killed in a hit and run. She looks so happy. Erica Simmons, 21, was killed in a hit and run. Springwood. The local police are searching for a driver who fled the scene of a crash which injured a driver and killed a young woman. Your St. Martin's Road. Erica Simmons was a star swimmer in her high school and got a full tuition college scholarship just a week ago. She's 21 and still in high school? Oh my gosh. It was just a regular day. I was just making a turn and my best friend is gone. Just like that. Uh, said June Kovac, who was a friend of the victim and the driver of the crashed car. I don't know who they are, but... My thoughts and prayers go to them and their families, said Mina De Silva, a witness of the accident, who called the ambulance. The police urge anyone with information regarding the accident to come forward. Wait a second. Mina didn't know this person at all? And she wrote an entire... Interesting. I mean, that's not the strangest thing to write a song about. A death to you. I mean, she was, she was technically, she witnessed it. So that's still pretty scarring. But. Yeah. She said it was a close friend in her song. So that is definitely warping the narrative a little bit. I'll see to it. Oh, no. I forgot. What have you got to say this time about Mina? Maya's not having any of this, guys. So does this... Wait, I have I have thoughts after this call. Wait a second. Um, sorry. I'm really not up for talking right now. I don't have the space for it. I'm just feeling so torn up as it is. Yes. Feeling so torn up. You're feeling so torn up. Maya? You tore me up. 
No. No, 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 no. Ah, loud. I even knew it was coming. I was... Uh... Mm. It hurts. I, I, I knew it was coming. I knew it was going to happen. And it still got me. Yeah, it's one of those games. It's one of those games. Uh, I could tell. All right, it happened. Oh! I... Mm -mm. No. We got a new video from my laptop. <laughs> this is a long one. That was a real brother moment. What you got? So she's recording herself sleep. So this is Maya. I'm recording this as proof. Yeah. Proof of what? I've been hearing it for weeks, every night. Oh no. And you're gonna hear it too? You hear that, right? I'm not crazy! What are we supposed to be hearing? I hear this, a slight static. I also have to sneeze. Stop. Make it stop. Ooh. Dude. Maya's getting it a lot worse than I thought she was. Get away from me! That was a very salivated breathe-in. Ooh. Oh, I know where this goes. This gives this gives us information. Information at its finest. Also, she I wasn't she wasn't seeing things, she was hearing things. What a poorly named piece of video. I I don't like that background. I I despise the background. Uh -huh. No. Men are trash. Well, that's not not a surprise and this one is particularly slimy uh upset emoji upset emoji slimy like the stunt you pulled with the lauren oh got him <laughs> not all slimes <laughs> i like not all slimes because <laughs> it's a parody of someone trying to parody something pretty great actually triple parody oh Righty. Um, we can get gym security. Gym employee giving someone security advice to Maya. Maya at her gym locker. What the? Your feeties hurt. Do a little foot massage. Uh, little little foot soak. Nice little hot bath. Big hot bath guy. Uh, okay. It was only after using TRM both Maya and Emily. Experience strange visions and hearing voices. Oh, so this is Emily's. Oh, oh, so this is my talking to someone about. Oh, interesting, interesting, interesting. Wait, a big hot bath guy or a big guy in a hot bath or both? leave that one up to your imagination young jack i'll leave that one up to your imagination all right so this is whilst maya is so this is poster in contact with trm and probably starting to see things because it's october and that's when things kind of got all funky for her hey emily this is uh maya maya crane i know your friend florence sorry but i don't have time for the formalities um do you use trm oh no 
Because Florence is who introduced her to TRM, which is where this thing is coming through. I feel like telling Morello about TRM was important. Did we ever tell Morello about TRM? Because I feel like that'd be a prime thing to investigate. All right, sorry. Uh, yes, this is beyond spooky. I need to talk to someone about this too. Have you seen Florence? I saw her posting yesterday, but about her new cat? Uh, no, have you, have you seen her? Like, with your own eyes? I'm not that close to her. We actually don't hang out that much. Why? I haven't seen her. Physically. Like, we've been talking online, but she never wants to meet up. I was at the Aloran Press thing last week and saw her posting pics of the event. But I didn't see her there. At all. What the hell? Have, have you been seeing or hearing voices? Seeing things? Uh, yeah, yeah. How, how do you know about that? Does this have something to do with TRM? I even caught some incidents on camera. And that's the video we saw. I swear, I saw something there. Oh no. You, you have to stop using it. It's gonna get worse. Someone is watching and messing with you. Have you told anyone else? Uh, my friends. I got them to sign up for TRM too. The Ripple Man will come for you and your friends. The what? Look up Adam DuPont. I introduced TRM to him too. And when I started hearing the voices, I told him to be careful. He's, he's smart. Maybe, maybe he figured something out. I've been trying to call him, but it keeps telling me he's out of service. Okay. Uh, can, can I have his number then? Three hours later. I like how, I like how the text narrates the spot. <laughs> it's like the, sorry. It's like the SpongeBob title cards. Four hours later. But it's in your phone. That's great. Uh, <laughs> Emily, are you there? Yeah. Yeah, I'm here. How, how do I contact Adam? Stay out of my business, Maya. Don't worry about it. Focus on bettering yourself. Those are all three very strange things. Uh, what? Are, Emily, are, are you okay? I'm fantastic. And you will be too. Soon. Emily got got. Emily... God, God. Oh, and Arya's goodbye, pretty much. Wow, Mina's such a gaslighter. Acting all innocent and smiles in front of you, and when you least suspect it, she just grabs what she needs. Well, her disguise isn't fooling anyone oh, now. I hate these people so I'm gonna much. I'm going to put her under the spotlight and expose her for the two-faced rat that she is. These, these people miss the point so much. You go, hey, what you're doing is pretty scummy. And they're like, yeah, it's scummy, all right. But I got to do it. But this person, they're doing something scummy. So I got to call them out. And you're like, wait a second. Wait a second, that doesn't that doesn't add up. You're both doing something scummy. What if you just both stopped? Ooh, Mina. How? How is she not? Look at that ratio. That is a Ripple Man ratio if I've ever seen one. Shout out to the folks at BCBG for having me over there to perform. It was, that should be capitalized. It was such an honor to sing on the same stage where all the greats have performed before me. Uh, thank you to all my fans for getting me here. This seems like Greg 2.0 moment. Listen, all the people, all of Maya's friends are Greg 2.0s, okay? There, there's, there's no one wholesome in this besides Detective Morello. Detective Morello is the only person who's not completely insane. Or a complete scumbag. Uh, you brought the house down. Killer voice. Good performance. Could use more plucking technique. 4 out of 10. Lol, nice disc jockey impersonation. Or impression. Try not to derail you, but what are your thoughts um, on the Halo games? They're fun. I like the Halo games. I never played the multiplayer much, but it's a really fun basement game. I like to play with your friends on a like Saturday or Friday night. That was like a lot of high school for me. Good times. Good times. Um, and I played through the, I played through one through reach, um, on stream. 
check DMs. But I put, yeah, I played through one through Reach on stream last year. Oh my gosh. Why? <laughs> you derailed me. You, you said not to derail me and you derailed me. Oh, I've been derailed. <sighs> okay. Sorry. I'm back in. I'm back in. Uh, too bad this review has a... <laughs> wait, what? Can't wait for impending meltdown. Thanks for the hookup, Rex. Yeah, don't mention it at all, Mina. Cap yeah, seriously. Dude, Halo 3 was pretty fun. I enjoyed Halo 3 a lot. I enjoyed the music in Halo 1 the best, though. It's really funky. All right, let's hear, let's hear her out. Dang, everyone's recording. And no one can... Why can't you hold your phone still? Fucking technique. Jack, I want your honest rating of this, okay? I want your honest rating once this is done. So this is the same song she did before. It's definitely improved from that. Monkst. A little short, uh, but not terrible. Not the worst. That was mid. <laughs> Okay, but now think about she wrote that um, and described that she wrote it because a close friend of hers passed away when in reality it was someone she didn't know. It was just a car crash in front of her. So put that into perspective. No, not you. I wanted to go for pull up that post again to make sure I'm reading that correctly. This one. Um, Did I not grab this before? I didn't grab this before? This one I grabbed this before. Okay, then it's less than mid. Yeah, here we go. Today, this is the 1st of August, and it's my birthday. It also marks the time where I lost Erica in a car accident. Thankfully, they arrested the driver, but it still hurts. I want you guys to know that Erica... Or know about Erica, because she's an important part of who I am. Every year, every birthday, I play that song as a tribute to her. Here's to you, Erica Simmons. I love you. Um, yeah, just some... <laughs> that's... Okay, that's kind of weird. Uh... I lost a best friend. Yeah. So, she... Lost a random... She didn't lose anyone because she didn't know this person. And definitely this part's all made up. But like... You can still write a song like that. Just... why I don't understand why she had to have the... Fake sob story in the background. Holy cow. She... Yeah, she blew up there. Also, 808 posts. But I can only see 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6... What? Why was... Why is that like that then? Don't understand. Anyways... Anyways, it was definitely Mina. Mina definitely did it, 100%. Let's update the text Morello on our progress. Also, first off, he said, ignore that video. Do not open it. It's highly confidential. Not for your eyes. Also, great news. The higher-ups agreed to a small field team to apprehend the culprit. Nice. So do whatever it takes to prevent the Ripple Man's influence from spreading. Not dry. Wait, not knowing how to count to seven. What did what did, what did, what did, what did, what did, what did, what did I do? Did I not count something right? Hmm. What did I do? I don't even remember saying a number. Anyways, what did you do? Did I did I count the numbers of posts wrong? All right, listen. There's less than eight hundred and eight. That's the main point. Detective Morello, what are you doing? I just struggle. <laughs> Sometimes I struggle, okay? You guys know this. You know this. And this is why... This is why we like Detective Morello. He's just an old man. Trying his best. And at least this time he realized he sent us to video. 
Oh, you know that guy? His name's Ra Randy Morello. Never would have guessed. He does kind of look like a Randy. Uh, they're all giving conflicting statements. Everyone's pointing fingers at each other, because they all are, honestly. Uh, this is turning out to be quite messy. Any theories as to who our perp is? Uh, nothing concrete yet, but I have a theory. That's fine. Cover all your bases before making a judgment. Things will clear uh, once we get... Wait. Things will be clear once we get through the last of our suspects. If we don't identify the culprit soon, the team will take me in instead, along with all my research. And we can forget about exposing these simulacra. Uh, I'm only interested in the truth. Uh, uh, then be prepared, because the truth is often ugly and uncomfortable. Oh, one more thing to go. Wrap it up and let me know. Wait, only one more thing to know. Wrap it up and let me go. I thought this was going to go somewhere else. So I add them. I thought I'd seen it all in my 35 years on the force. Mm -hmm. But this really takes the cake. We're living in a different world now. Mm -hmm. and it's more dangerous than you realize. I didn't like that. We're not alone. And we're not at the top of the food chain anymore. Oh. I won't sugarcoat it. People are going to doubt hey. you. Say Call you a phony. But this story needs to get out. <laughs> Wait, it Cat, needs what? To. My neighbor's name is Randy. I swear the man is a nudist and is deaf. It's the worst combination. Hey man, more power to him. What's his no? Jack stop. Jack no. Um the special privilege yeah. The special privileges of dupe are currently being reviewed. All ongoing dupe investigations will be placed directly under HQ until farther notice. Requesting for temporary personal or temporary personnel has been granted for 24 hours. Field Team Delta is now under Dupe's command. It's Dupe. It, and we, we got the explanation of what it is at one point. I don't remember what it is. Dupe. People like. People order our patties. This one? Hey. Mina's image discussion. A discussion with Mina regarding her involvement in a road accident which led to Erica's death. The incident is also farther detailed than a police report. I hate that background so much. Oh. <laughs> All right. So, uh, have you thought about it, Mina? Oh, you, you mean my backstory? Yeah. But also, my idea about using Erica. Maya suggested using Erica? Unless you have anything else. Uh, I don't know. It feels kind of low. Scummy, even. Can I really use the accident, her death, to boost my profile? I mean, all artists are tor tortured souls, right? No, that's a really bad misconception. Uh, sorry. That was stupid of me. Uh, do you trust me? Or, sorry, that was stupid. That was, that was stupid. I read that stupidly. Um, yeah, you know I do. Then, yeah, I think you should do it. It's just, what's really happening is not that interesting. Then dramatize it a little. Documentaries do it all the time. No one's going to dig out a police report or anything. Eh, you'd be surprised. Besides, it happened in Springfield, so hardly anyone would know. So, like, just fluffing, fluffing it up, right? Yeah. Just some tweaks here and there. You want to inspire people with your music, right? I do. But use your pain. A lot of people can relate to trauma. Seeing you strong, persevering, succeeding. That's powerful. Debatable. Not when it's super fake, though. Um, I'm not sure if I'm good enough to pull that off. Mina, stop selling yourself so short. You've got more talent in your little pinky most of these trash musicians just need to apply yourself better um and believe in yourself because i believe in you 
That's the nicest thing anyone's ever said to me. Okay. You're right. Uh, a good story gives people hope. I think I'm starting to see what you mean. It gives me an idea for a new song, too. There you go. Thank you, Maya. You're a good friend. Happy to help. So Maya gave Mina the original idea to use this as her background. Interesting. Interesting. Mina looks like... Wait, Mansman looks like he's been carrying twins for, for 10 months, dude. Oh, man. Detective Morello sent an audio recording. What'd you send? What are you talking about, Morello? You know, for someone who's such a tragic rock star, I don't buy any of Mina's melodrama. I forgot he can see There's everything. No record of any of her stories. Yeah. See if she mentions any specific incident. She does. Something you can look up on the police database. It covers everything from murder to accidents. I forgot. Road accidents. <gasps> it's almost like... It's almost like they knew. It's almost like they knew. One second. Uh, oh, this is the guy. This is the guy we were supposed to contact. That uh, Erica told us to contact. Un momento, poor favor. My brother was better than me at everything. School, sports, social life. Even our shared camera channel everything came naturally to him it was an unspoken competition and everyone questioned why i wasn't on the same level how is he better than you if he's younger living in his shadow was suffocating taking the deal changed me it was the push i needed to start living for myself and to find my own identity living in his shadow was suffocating adam dupont Hmm. Hey, are you coming back to school? You disappeared and missed quarters of the semester. Or missed a quarter of the semester? I don't know how that's going to be. Uh, uh oh. Spaghetti-o. Um. Oh, wait a second. Maya bribing for contact info. Huh? Gym security? Maya at her gym locker. Do we have a picture? Let's see here, real quick. Um, let's go to her photos. We need a picture of Maya at her gym locker. Also, we don't know who this guy is. There's no locker. That's just the gym. Hmm. That's not her locker, is it? No. I don't see a picture of her at her gym locker. Huh. Is that Rex? No, it's not. Huh. Oh, look at that. We're, we've almost got all of our stuff. Downloads? No. My laptop? No. Videos? Hi, namaste, you guys. Oh, this is the light one. We have seen this one. I didn't remember what that one was. That makes more sense. Ah, I still hate that picture. Let's get out of here. Um, okay, first of all, I need to look at the Erica's death chat again, this one, because we need names and we need Erica Simmons. All right, writing this down, Erica Simmons, two S's, two M's. Um, when did this happen? It's happened in Springwood, near St. Martin Road. You like clowns? What? I mean, I don't... I would say I... 
on a scale of like to dislike, the clowns are farther on the dislike side than the like side. You know what I'm saying? You know what I'm saying? I would not actively seek out a clown, is what I am saying. Uh, so I guess Springwood? I don't know when this happened. When did this happen? August. Um, okay, yes. August. So we got a warden. Look up. Go to accident. Uh, Eric. Oh my gosh. Oh my gosh. Erica Simmons. District. Springwood. August. Did I do it right? Did I do it right? Did I do it right? Nice. Got it. All right. August 8th. Hit and run. Wow. They got that report out real quick. Day after. Oh, we got a diagram too. Person involved. June Kovac, driver. Erica Simmons, passenger, deceased. Witness Mina De Silva. Okay. Unknown driver. It was about 7.30 p.m. And we were stopped at the red light intersection at Springwood. The light had just turned green and we were attempting to cross. That's when a man in the black sedan came from St. Martin's Road, ran the light, and slammed into the passenger side of our car, hitting Erica Simmons. It sped off before we realized what was happening. A few drivers from the other cars stopped to help, and they stayed with us until the ambulance arrived. But no one remembers the plate of the car that hit us. Uh-oh. Uh, the officer's report. The collision inflicted grievous wounds upon the front passenger, Erica Simmons. Emergency services stated that she was dead the moment before they arrived on the scene. Oh, that's so sad. The driver, June Kovac, suffered slight trauma. Uh, they were interviewed before being escorted to the hospital for treatment. No traffic cameras were located at the incident, but a witness statement by Mina De Silva was able to corroborate June Kovac's version of the events. As of now, no new information is known about the hit and run from the vehicle. Here's June. Hey, June here. If you're listening to this, that means I can't come to the phone. I will text you soon. I didn't think that called him. I thought it was... I thought it was a recording of the call. But hopefully we can get some information from June. We don't need this one. Okay, that's what we needed though. Who is this and what do you want? That's not what I do when I get a text or a call from an unknown number. I usually just block it or wait to see if they call me back or leave a message. Uh Ooh, how do I want to play this? How do I want to play this? I'm covering a story about hit and runs when you came up. I got a tip about your hit and run. Um, because this top one, I'm sure they don't want to talk about it anymore. I'm sure it's very mentally exhausting for them. Um, but also I don't have a tip about their hit and run. What do you want is so aggress aggressive? Yeah, but it's also like, you know, my rule is if I don't know your number, it's important. Yeah, if it's important, they'll, they'll leave a message. It, exactly. That's how I feel too. That's how I feel too. If it's really important, they'll leave a message. I'm um, covering stories about hit and runs and you came up. This is the honest route because I really don't have a tip. I wonder what it, I wonder what it'll make me say if I do this one though. Let's try this one. I should have done the other one. I already regret it. But the investigation was closed years ago. I already spoke with the press. What? Why now again? I need to confirm Mina's side of the story. Mina. Oh. Is that the name of the hit and runner? No. Wait, I think, I think the driver's the guy. Mina sounds like a girl's name. Sorry, I, I got carried away. 
My therapist told me to let it go, but I knew deep down I was holding on to it for some reason. Uh, it's about the other witness. How well do you know Erica's best friend, Mina? Oh, you're, you're not making any sense. I... I was Erica's best friend. Who's... Who's Mina? Wait. There was... There was another girl there. She was the one who called the ambulance. Wasn't... Wasn't she involved in the crash, too? I mean... Yes and no? Seriously, I think this is going nowhere, so... Whatever point you're trying to make, just... Can you please be straightforward? You're not gonna like this, but... She's been claiming online. She's... What a lying snake. Who gave her the right? She's talking about the accident. And using Erica's name. So is, is her tr story true? I mean, it's a true event. But I'm Erica's best friend. Not her. She just... She stole my story. And is passing it off as a tragedy... Or the tragedy as her own. Why would someone do that? I mean, I've heard of people... Presenting themselves as heroes. But as a victim. That's just pathetic. I'm trying to expose her. Great. I hope you do. <laughs> These bloody camera stars. All just looking for dramas and wait. Are just looking for drama in their empty pouring lives. Putting themselves on pedestals while using pain to fish for pity likes. Why not just snap a selfie with Erica's corpse, you bitch? Oh my gosh. Oh my gosh. You're in Spain minus the S. What? <laughs> That's a good one. I like that one. <laughs> um. I need I need content or concrete evidence to prove that. Still want proof? I do. Yes. Thank you, June. Our local paper covered it. I already have this. The article quotes that. The lying tart Mina says that she doesn't know us. Using her real death to tell a fake story. That's pure evil. I'm sorry. I'm not in the mood to talk anymore. You got what you need, right? I need I need to be alone now. I'm sorry, June. Thank you for your help. I'm sorry. I did not mean to bring up your trauma. Okay, so that's just another way to get this. That's just another way to get this article. But I thought we needed this article to get to June. I'm confused. Or is that just confirming of... I still hate this. Mm, I don't... Stop. Get away from my screen. I don't like the face. Oh. Oh, that got a lot really quick. All right. Mina De Silva lied about Erica being her best friend. I'm Erica's best friend. I lost someone I cared about. And the audacity to turn my trauma into profit is absolutely horrifying. Thanks for getting on top of this. That's sick. Who the hell does that? Oh, I knew there was something wrong about her. I'm DMing you. So can you please respond? Oh. Mina is trying to cover her tracks. Mina, look at the likes though. They're still coming in. I'm just a girl sitting with my guitar asking you to keep rocking on. Yes, I'm super excited to tell you folks that I've got a new record deal. Also, rock and roll never dies. You're... Her genre's not rock and roll at all. Her genre's not even close to rock and roll. Wow. Just earlier, you were so sad about your friend. Great. Another sad, mopey singer. Just what our airwaves need more of. I can't believe you sold out. Lame. Reimburse everyone for your shows you canceled. True. Fair. Uh, watch your mass cancel thing. Uh, things when the negative reviews come in. I liked you better when you were sad. 
want to be happy about this, but I'm still disappointed in you. Careful, June doesn't sue if you put that song about Erica in there. True. Now Maya died. She knows what it's like to lose a friend now. <laughs> That's so bad. You people are evil. It's sickening. Did you just at yourself? Wait, what? Cringe? This is bad. This is like, yes. So she wrote a song about her friend, her dear friend dying. And they're like, hey, well, that wasn't real. And then somebody goes, no, it's fine. Her friend actually died now, so that song's irrelevant. And you go, ugh, ugh. I don't know about that one, Chief. I mean, sad that her friend died, but also still. I don't, mm, it's, this is, I just, ah, this hurts my soul. All right, I have to ask you about this. Why are you triggering me with this? What the heck? Oh, this manipulative little Mina. Oh, I didn't know they did such a big report. You twisted this story so much. Yeah, call it right out. Tell her we know everything. No, I, I mean, her death is real. It was based on true events. Okay. Okay, I don't know her personally, but it really did affect me. I witnessed someone dying. Yeah, I mean, that would affect you, yeah, but... What a scummy thing to do. Why did you make it your story? You could have just, like, this is a perfectly fine thing to write about. Seeing death and it affecting you and writing about that. Like, that would have been totally fine. You just took it a really weird route. Um, I'm sorry, okay? I had to. Also, she could have left out names for sake and whatnot. Um, people don't want to just listen to your music. They want the whole package. The way you look, act, it has to match. So it's just branding? You're benefiting from other people's grief. Ooh, calling her out. Give her the rain cloud. Give her the rain cloud. I'm expressing their grief for them. My head! Ah! The stupidity, it hurts. The lack of concern for others. Ah. What's the term? What's that one term? I can't think of the name. They assumed privilege. I, I can't. Oh, this hurts my brain. Uh, there's a difference. You totally don't get it. People think it's easy to get discovered, but there's so many musicians out there be authentic you have to change your reality a little i couldn't reach people with my music before but now everyone's listening to me i just want people to listen to me that trauma was real for someone i know that okay i was trying to help morello what just another day in morello's life why do they always stick me with these idiots i swear he butt dialed me again. Uh, you, of all people, you've been doing this too long. Morello. What, just because I take the weirdo cases, everybody's going to work against me? Stick me with the losers? Oh, come on, not another one. Morello. Maybe if I... Nah. Morello. You huh? butt dialed me again. Oh, yes. Oh, man. Yeah, <sighs> thank you. Classic Morello. All right, what was this? I know that. I was trying to help. I went too far, okay? I admit it. I just... People liked the rock star Mina so much more than the real me. Rock star Mina? What do you... She's just throwing around words. She doesn't even know what she wants to be. Bad. Bad musician. Bad influencer musician. Uh, When the criticism started, I exaggerated even more because... So I just wanted people, or wanted everyone to stop, and I don't know what to do. You're just using self-pity for attention. We're thunderclouding her. You sound like Arya and Rex. When the deal thing came up, I was already uncomfortable even thinking of taking another easy way out. Plus, the sacrifice thing was totally weird, so I ignored it. Wait. Wait. 
Ooh. Ooh, okay. Thought process. I still think it's Mina. Um. But if she is telling the truth at this part, it could have mean it could mean she took the deal, but just ignored the fact that they needed a sacrifice. So instead of Mina or Mina technically choosing who to sacrifice, the Ripple Man just came and took Maya. It just took one on its own, you know. Hmm. That's entirely possible. So it could have been an unintentional killing, but it still happened. Is Arya saying all this? Have you been talking to her? And why are you asking all these weird questions? What do you mean? What else did she say about me? Arya told me about all of your lies. The other one was not going to work. What does that mean? Why is everyone being so mean to me? How come you're just trusting whatever Arya says? Maybe she's the one who did it. You haven't answered the question. Uh, you, you, what, 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 maybe she's the one who did it. She's all about making herself look good. Like her whole camera, camera is fake. I keep saying camera. So Ari's lying. I'm so just so she's lying. Uh, that's that's pretty irrelevant. This is so relevant. Her fans got super mad at her for lying, so she had to fix that. Ari doesn't look like it, but she's a toxic person. You're all toxic people. Aren't super ambitious people like that kind of crazy about getting what they want? I think she'd get a lot of benefit from the Ripple Man's deal. Uh, I mean, that deal would benefit you too. No. People think I'm an overnight success, but it's been years of hard work, okay? I'm okay with starting from scratch again. Aria would rather die than do that. I think Aria is the one that made uh, us all, wait, made us all to lie about what happened to Maya that night. What else did Aria tell you to do? Let's see, how does Rex fit in all this, Mina? Let's see if you can point fingers both ways. He was so rude to Maya that night. True, he was. We saw the video. Um, after that, everything... Or after... After everything happened, he was... Going on that... It had to be some gas leak or something stupid like that. Arya had to shut him up. I've never been... Or I've never seen him that scared. What if... What if he just pretended to be scared? Oh my god, I'm so confused right now. And I'm like the real idiot for going along with Arya and Rex. God, they're the worst. Of course, one of them would have done this. Uh, of course, one of them would have done this to poor Maya. Maybe even both together. Why would... I want her... I still don't think it was Rex. Because I do believe Rex would try to make it Kind of on his own. I think a little bit. That's more his style. Um, Even if it was a trash way. You know. I want to see her opinion on her. Honestly, I want her opinion on both. But I know she's been losing jobs. I didn't dare ask her about it. She gets really defensive sometimes, you know. But anyway, she's she was out of cash and pretty desperate for work. Uh, That's why she faked her brand endorsement. I didn't want to say the other one, but this is... Too much info I wanted to give out. Like, that was so OTT, right? I don't know what that means. Uh, she actually seriously posted, like, the worst fake apology video ever. That was really bad. After we got that deal thingy, she started getting all the big brands on her side. Like, even a modeling gig? No one wanted to give her work. And then suddenly she's hot stuff again. Um, what about Rex? Rex is a total user. Loser? User? He got away with conning like so many people, but his fans. Disbelieve everything he says. It's really weird. Like, I don't think it's normal. Uh, 
Why is that weird? He definitely didn't learn from his past mistakes. Like, nothing bad sticks to him now. So many people have tried to complain about his weird business. And Maya said she was sick of hearing him rant about that. But now it's like all these complaints went away. Only the Ripple Man can make that happen. Isn't it extreme to sacrifice Maya for this? Everyone does sound like a total user. Um, Rex thinks everyone's big game and they're... Wait, uh, Rex thinks everything's one big game and he just plays people. He sees people like like they're his prawns or something. Pawns. I think you're right. Oh my G. OMG, I'm right? I knew he was that selfish. I can't believe he gave up Mai's life for his... For more followers. Wait. And it's, uh, da, 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 I don't know about that one. That's pretty out of context. I'll look into it. I still don't think it's Rex. Rex is a scumbag for sure, but I don't think it's Rex. I 100% think it's Mina. Or all of them. Are we calling Rex now? Finishing the loop? I don't actually think it's Rex. But we'll let Ghost Maya get out her grievances against actual Rex. Jeez, what now? I swear to God, I'm gonna find out what you look like, and if I ever see your face in person. Do you wanna see my face now? No. Not again. Wow, what the what the I don't. I've seen it, it's scary. Very funny. You almost sounded like Maya. Do you wanna see it? No. I really don't. I really don't. I'm ready for it. I still don't want to see it. That was Rex's face. That was Rex's face. Oh, no, 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 no. What did you just say, Mina? What did you just say? Oh, my God. I think the Ripple Man, like... Just spoke to me. What did it say? Oh, no, no, no. I don't really get it, but someone about not trusting anyone? You have to help me stop it. Oh, here they go again. Oh, the whole pack's coming. What, did Jab what was the Jabber post? You're a mean girl. That's all you'll ever be. That's about Arya. All right. I think this is the tipping point, folks. I think things are about to get real juicy. All right. <laughs> Mina, you lying bitch. You killed Maya. No, Rex took the Ripple Man's deal. What? Arya, the two-faced cow. Or Arya's the two-faced cow who did this to us. That's a great <laughs> two-faced cow. Are you freaking stupid? Why the hell would I do that? Because you're a murderer. Not a very compelling case. Like, hello? You're totally the killer, Rex. Are you just going to bicker till the Ripple man, Ripple man shows up? You all are the worst. I'm reporting all of you to the cops. Not that one. That one's really lame. Um, I feel like this is just going to upset them. This is going to upset them even more. But directly. Um, let's do this one. Maybe there's a chance it gets some sense into them. <gasps> like this. You're right. We, we end this right here and now. Yeah. You're supposed to solve this, right? Oh my gosh. Who do you think took the deal? You know it's one of those two. It has to be Arya or Rex. Or both. Dude, Mina, she doesn't even know who it is. She just keeps throwing it out. One of you obviously did. I'm not comfortable with this. What? One of you obviously did. Wow. Excellent work. I know it's Rex or Arya. I should have sorted this out myself. I think it was Mina. I really do think it was Mina. I don't know if this is the end all be all decision. Um, but I do think it was Mina. Just based off of how 
you kind of wouldn't think it's her but this is insane her like ratios shot up they're the that's like the most compelling evidence for me she went from this so like that's like a 50 percent. this is a negative 50 percent to absurd that's over a hundred that's over 200 over 300 crazy siv hi hello there hello there welcome to chili's that says there's there's no way these these went crazy as opposed to rex who's he got a little bit but the ratio is still not crazy that one's kind of crazy that one's not, though. You just had the one post that kind of popped, and that was it. Which happens. Um, and Aria. Nope, that's normal for her. That's normal. Normal. She stayed consistent, like, the whole time of a little above, besides this one, which she got called out on. Yeah. It was the likes because it was about Maya. Exactly. This was an old one, so she, she already had potential to do a big thing. Yeah. Yeah. I, I think it's Mina. I think it's Mina. Um, everyone here is a scumbag. But it was Mina. Achievement unlocked. Deduction. I... I didn't do it. You know... You know I'd never harm Maya. You're both just against me because I'm the only one who cared about her. Just admit it already. Why? Why are you being this way? Please, I, I really didn't do it. I should have seen the signs. All of you only think about yourselves. Mm, uh, the rich considering... That's rich considering you summoned a demon. I killed Maya. You signed up for the service too. Uh, we know our limits, Mina. You're way out of control now. Why are we still talking? Can't we, like, contain her or something? If that's what you all think... I'm going to start acting like the person you want me to be. Oh, she definitely did it. I can still help. Listen, I can literally still help if you cooperate. Like, and you cannot get Ripple Man. I don't need your help anymore. I just took the Ripple Man's deal. Oh! No! Oh, no. I guessed wrong. No. Wait. No. No. <laughs> this is so not good. Something's off about this. What if we're wrong? Uh, shouldn't we do something to stop her? She might come for us, you know? I'll handle this. As much as I wish, I didn't have to. Sounded horrible as one was expected for Max. Yeah. Listen, this is... My deduction skills... Yeah, we have to instruct Merlo and the team to capture... Okay, thank God. I thought this was gonna pop off again. <sighs> um... Band to a friend. We have this, right? What the? Oh, I clicked on the wrong thing. Um, the only thing I could think of that would have given us more information would have been had I figured these out. But I want to just keep going. Send the team for Mina. My God, you solved it? Are you, are you sure you're right? No. No room for mistakes here. I think the Ripple Man got to her. What do you mean got to her? I'm prepping the team. Are you still on the line with them? She blocked me. She can't be contacted. The phone is acting. Uh, she blocked me. She didn't block me, but she left the group chat. She better not be doing anything rash. I'll expedite it. Now please, uh, get me up to speed. I need to know... What to expect when we bust down that door. Nothing good. Probably a... S Hello? Oh. 
No. She does not look very scared of this. We're seeing this through the Ripple Man, I think. Yo, I kind of want to see what this guy looks like, though. No, no, Ew. it was that's it. Who was it? Did I do it? I like this. This is fun. Yeah, I'm. <sighs> I'm a little confused. I'm not going to lie. Also, does this just go? Or do I need to like click? This is a really fun screensaver. Oh, it just goes. Long left. Oh. What is this? Your name for our kind, yes? We are Ripple Man. I am Groot. What do you want? We seek souls who can manipulate others into believing new truths. Why do you need them? They help us extend our influence. Souls like you who know the choices of others. Your words fed Mina's despair. For us. I was so sure it was her. I was. I'm being honest here. And so it was. <sighs> Why are you doing this? We seek connections to this world. So you're we now wish to hmm. interesting. Now we are One word. Star. Less Why descriptive. That was a much better us? word. The detective. He led you astray, yes? You can fix it. No, oh, I'm not falling for no he didn't. Feathers eventually do. You may have a taste. We can alter reality as it is perceived by others. Oh? You can make them see whatever you wish. The ripple effect. Choose your version. I know you hacked. Or I know you hacks don't follow things through. But now's not the time to disappear on me. Hey, where the hell are you? I think I'm in a different dimension. You better not be pulling my leg. Are you okay? Are you with the simulacrum? Um. So now the choice is, I don't want to do Detective Morello dirty. I, we had a pretty decent relationship the whole time. We were just kind of helping each other out. I mean, he had a couple spats at me, but like he was useful. He was the most competent person in this entire investigation, you know? I don't like either. I don't like any of these. I'm fine. You need to act now. It looks like it's too late for Mina. That's at least valuable. But like, I want to say I'm with Sim Simulacrum. 
So, we're heading to another body. Or something worse. Yeah, I also like the voice of the simulacrum. This one's really good. The team and I are almost at the scene. So are we right about our perp? It's, uh... I think it is more complicated than that. I think it might be more complicated than that. Oh, okay. Hear me out. Hear me out. What if... What if... No one took the deal. Okay? What if the deal was the red herring? Like a really big red herring. There is no right answer as to who actually did the murder. It is more complicated than that. It's just... It's either you make the deal... Or you don't make the deal in time no matter what the simulacra is coming for you anyway. You know? Like, why would it have to... Why would it be restrained by a deal? You know? Why wouldn't it just go for you? If it's this strange other dimensional like cyber demon thing no one took it because Maya was the first so she died because she wouldn't decide yeah that's what I'm thinking that's what I'm thinking and then we lost Mina because she then decided to take the deal so that's why it showed up but she didn't like the deal would have been her sacrificing someone so why did she sacrifice herself when that doesn't make sense because then she's not there you know what I'm saying I think it's more complicated I think it's more complicated I don't think anyone ever took the deal except for Mina right now but that's yeah yeah. What? I I need straight answers. This case is going to either make or break dupe. Dupe. Um, the team and I are here. Best guys on this force. If we're wrong about this, they'll be taking me instead. And if dupe is dissolved, dupe. Um, <laughs> there'll be no one left to look at these creatures. Yeah, it's death complicated. Uh. Gosh, these ah, these responses are so. They happen every game. They're so not what needs to be said right now. What'll happen to me? We know what's gonna happen to him. He's gonna be put away. You're a ghost. You don't exist in this investigation. Pog, as far as they know, I acted alone. Pog, I can't let all the work I put into dupe just end. The truth needs to be exposed. So please, tell me what we got this... Or tell me we got this right. Yeah! Yeah! We made a mistake. No one... None of them caused Maya's death. Yes! What? How is... How is that possible? You gave me wrong until Mina only took the deal moments ago. Maya took the deal and that's what killed her. Mina only took the deal moments ago. What? Uh, then who caused Maya's death? Maya. She she did this to herself, didn't she? Oh, God. It was so obvious. Why didn't I see that? We got it all wrong. What have I done? I don't take full responsibility, but, uh, it's not your fault. I, I mean, of course it is. I pinned all this on those poor kids. My pigheadedness killed his, this case and gave the Ripple Man another victim. Don't give up now. Don't give up now. No, I, I pushed so hard for my version of the truth. Uh, they're not gonna cut me any slack now. Disappointing. Break. I offered you to alter your reality. Yet you exposed the truth. Nice! Okay, that's good. Morals. Morals! Uh, it was the right thing to do. I'll never do what you want. Piss off, Simulacra. Oh. Oh, they were testing me. Morello's not the only one. You think you can stop me? No. I, I know it. For someone who accepts the world they are given. <laughs> hey, fire cheers. Thank you the eight months. Big fan, big fan. No, eight months streak. Twelve months in a row. <gasps> That's a full year. Thanks, Ben. Uh 
I have no use for someone who accepts the world that they are given. Stagnant, possessive, unmoving. This is not the end. There is no end or beginning. Since authenticity is so precious to you, live with the knowledge that we are here now. Hmm. Eager to consume more. I don't know. Field Team Delta, please detain Detective Murillo and escort him back to HQ for processing. I don't know how I feel about it. I really don't. What are you doing here? It's me. Come to see my career meet its gruesome end? Just like those kids? What, now you feel bad? No. Look, we both know you think I'm some old, useless, doddering crackpot. But you know damn well as I do, I'm a great cop. We were so close until you cocked everything up. We could have saved them. So? You know why I was pushing you so hard on this? It was my only lead for so many victims. Something bad is coming our way. I can feel it in my bones. Mm. I think technically I chose a bad end. I think I could stop it. Forget it. Yeah, I did. Just leave. I did. I guess you tried your best. I'll explain in a second once this is over. Too bad it wasn't good enough. Oh, Morello, that stings. Those are all empty. Why are you packing them away? They're like two dollars. <sighs> he got fired. Of course, he got the bad ending. I mean, it's not the end of the world that he lost his job. He's he's fine. Um, but no, I think the reason it's a bad ending um, is because while we uh, we technically got a good ending via our character's morals, um, yeah we lost out on dupe um it's a weird thing of i think i played the character right because it's a reporter he wants only the truth to get out there so i played that hard reporter as opposed to supreme path because ideally we could have made morello protect his job and if he kept his job then he could be doing more stuff even if it meant the investigation was technically false. We could have pinned it on Mina, even though she leaves gone. Um, and got taken. So we could have pinned it on Mina, said she was taken, pulled all the strings, whatever type could be her. Dupe gets more money, more investigation, defeat the simulacrum. But instead, we decided to tell the truth about the investigation. Or what we believe the truth was, I guess. Go from there. Yeah. Just got to convince him to play a different end. I'm not going to play through for a different end. <laughs> no shot. <sighs> These people upset me too much for me to play through it again. I'll probably I'll probably eventually look up the other endings. See what happens. I want to know what actually happened. Um, But not enough to play it again. There's so many decisions in this game that I wish I would... Ooh. Ooh, she's just got different cuts. That's pretty pog. I like this. This is fun. Wow. Okay, so we still have a lot to unlock. Prize two and two for bad endings. All right, hear me out though. There are a ton of bad endings in this game. Okay. There's like, it's not like you get the bad, you get the good. It's there's a ton of bad endings. Yeah. How did I get nothing on Aria? Wait a second. 
I did not realize there's this much I could investigate. What the heck? The Ripple Man reveals itself. So then I assume like this is acclaims Rex, this is acclaims Aria. You told the truth to Morello and Duke will shut down. This is you lie and Duke keeps going. Okay. So, wait, what's this path? Okay, and then this is Arya, Mina, Rex fight with each other. You choose Rex, you choose Mina. Okay. Or you choose Arya. Okay. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah, that's how they're laid out. It's for, it's, it's, this is literally laid out for replay value. A hundred percent. Wow. Okay. Okay. Well, I mean, it do be like that sometimes. There's a lot going on. A lot of confusing information. Wow, it is hard being a detective. I don't even know what this is. This is a whole spot we didn't even touch. And who knows what that is? This links... This might be like the ultimate ending. I think this is the perfect ending. I would have had to go into a perfect path on Mina. A perfect path on Arya. And a perfect path on Rex. Apparently Rex, I was close to getting there. But Mina, I had four... Four more clues minimum. And Arya, I had three more clues minimum. Dang. But I almost got there with Rex. Rex sneaks. What? What? Rex sneaks into the police station. I did not get that. You try to convince Rex to help you. I did try that, I guess, but not. I did not try that. Interesting. Okay, well. Did you enjoy your experience? Yeah. Great. Give us skip. Nope. Uh, <laughs> that's a simulacrum too. Simulacra too? Simulacrum? You unlock fast mode. <gasps> oh, that's pretty fun. So you just skip through everything. And this is the tree? This is the tree. Yeah. Cool. Cool beans. Yeah, that's simulacra too. Fun game. Good time. Um. Yeah. If you want to know... What happens on the other endings? YouTube it. If you want to catch up and see all the choices I made, we'll be up on YouTube 